I would like to welcome you all uh, in the lecture series of management and uh, entrepreneurship. Uh, today, we are going to discuss about the roles of managers. Okay, what are the important roles of manager that we are going to discuss? Okay, so as you all know that uh, the, ma the managerial role is most significant, especially uh, for uh, like uh, helping uh, to the uh, organization to achieve the goal goals and objective to satisfy or to meet the mission and the vision okay then resources should be effectively utilized okay and uh, teams are motivated and productive these are the ultimate uh, motto okay if you can mark these are the ultimate goal of uh, like a uh, role of manager however we'll inspect individually first of all i will be talking about the planning how man ma the role of managers plays most important role in uh, planning for every activity, we require planning. Uh, managers are responsible for setting the goals. That is most important. Okay. Also, the developing the strategies. Then analyzing the present situation. What exactly happening surroundings? That is most important for uh, environmental scanning, or you can call it a, just like a market research. Then forecasting the future trends. What would be the future demand? For future forecasting. What kind of method can be adopted? And uh, creating the plans to guide the organization towards the objective. So these are the major uh, role of manager in the process called the planning. It is a first step. Second one is called the organizing. How the managers can help for organizing uh, the goals or organizing, organizing process. So manager organize the resources because uh, he should have, he or she should have a good idea about how much resources are available. Resources are scare resources and uh, how, to, how to manage the people and uh, how to manage the men and material and uh, financial resources, how to manage, uh, then make sure that uh, the resources are allocated efficiently. Okay. Also, the tasks are carried out effectively. These are the major thing which are comes under organizing. So planning and organizing, these are the most important uh, things which a manager can lead in a better way. Now, moving on to the thirds, uh, like uh, in, the th in the leading, Okay, how manager plays most important role in leading. So ma a good manager must be a good leader. Okay, they should have some leadership ca capability. They have to motivate and guide the employees working for uh, towards the common goal. Okay, because there are certain team member which are comes under manager. He has to he or she has to motivate the team members to achieve the goal. Setting a vision and uh, how to uh, meet the mission by using the uh, mission statements. Communicate the and expectation. Communication is the key uh, tool of the success in management. So inspiring the team members, okay, and motivate. So in the leading, uh, motivation plays most important role. Also, communication is the key of success. Second one is called, uh, next is called staffing. How the managers can play most important role in the staffing? Yes, of course, the staffing activity includes recruiting, then selecting, uh, training, the uh, training and developing the employees. And... Uh, to find the right person at the right time, that is most important. Okay. Finding out the right person at the right time, that is a quite important thing. So coordinating, how the managers has crucial important role in uh, coordinating. So manager coordinate the activities in different indi individual departments within the organization to make sure that everyone is focusing towards the same objective. Objective should be at a, like, a, there should be a target. There should be an objective. Okay, objective should be like, uh, it should not be deviated. It has to move to part a particular direction. And uh, facilitating the commu uh, communication, uh, solving the conflicts, uh, then integrating the effort across the team. There should be an integration and coordination that is required. Else, uh, we cannot meet the requirement. We cannot satisfy the requirement. So, uh, coordinating is also most important. Now, I'll be discussing about another important objective that is called uh, controlling. So, every organization, there, there should be some like... Uh, a reference uh, objective okay a target a reference a target reference uh, like what i can say a, a reference uh, per, uh, like a performance level will be there and the actual performance level also will be there so compare the reference performance level as well as our actual performance level take the difference uh, then based upon that a corrective action should be taken suppose if there are some process are lagging so try to overcome that particular thing so the role of another uh, role of manager is actually to control the process uh, so like take the corrective action so comparing the actual and the desired performance all right next is called a decision making 
decision making okay to take the right decision that is most important first decision should be so much effective okay uh, according to some theory says that whatever the decision you are taking first time that is most important the gather the information okay gather the information then evaluate the options there are different alternative uh, alternative one alternative two alternative three alternative four among these which option is most convenient if i choose option four what would be the consequences uh, choose the best course of action among the uh, like uh, alternatives there are different alternatives you need to choose the best one next one is called a problem solving analyze the issues then uh, generating solutions implement the effective problem solving strategies this is regarding the problem solving ultimately communication communication is the key of success and uh, managers has to communicate with the different levels of the organization maybe from lower level to upper level okay conveying the information okay uh, communication is the key we can say that uh, if, if if there are some hindrance in the communication entire uh, process will be getting delayed okay then expectation to the employees and the stakeholders these are the major uh, roles of managers controlling decision making uh, problem solving making effective communication these are the major roles okay so moving further then development we'll talk about the development okay so what about the development like uh, managers focus on the development of the employees then providing the proper feedback then uh, coaching opportunities for learning and the growth so this will uh, help for the employees to develop the skills and the capability to perform the current roles and prepare the future responsibility that is regarding the development so coaches and men men uh, mentors actually manager should act as a coach as well as mentors okay so managers play a crucial role helping the employees to develop their skills and grow their careers because career is most important as a manager they have to help to build their skills as well as careers for the future growth this involves providing the suitable uh, coach coaching okay providing the suitable like training uh, mentorship mentorship activity nowadays uh, people are actually more focusing on the mentorship than opportunity for professional development next is called a representatives so manager uh, represent the team entire team and uh, the, if, you, if they wanted to communicate with the ceo the manager uh, like uh, that represents a manager who represent the entire team that is go, they are go, the manager should have uh, a better idea about what is happening in the surroundings so what about the team members in their process they are going to convey the information with the higher authority okay also the stakeholders they could they could communicate with the stakeholders also so uh, the, they will act as a representatives manager will act as a representatives uh, in this uh, we can say that managers has very uh, managers have very much crucial role uh, in the management process these are the major roles and responsibilities of managers let me uh, you can expect this particular topic uh, for certain like a weightage maybe 10 marks or something like that also you should know as a, a engineering students or manage management students you should have a good idea about what is your role if you become a manager or if you become a team leader in a company so thank you for watching this video if you are watching our channel first time i request you to like this video and uh, then uh, share and if you if the channel is useful to you kindly subscribe our channel in order to get the uh, notification kindly put the bell button thank you very much for watching this video happy learning have a great day